So when people hear about gamification, they automatically think games. But in actuality, gamification is not about games. Gamification is a form of engagement, making your audience do various different actions that you want them to do, but making those actions more fun and engaging. So the standard definition, gamification is the use of elements of game design in non-game environments. Nike has done an awesome job with uh, taking something that's pretty mundane, running, uh, normally a solo activity, adding different layers of engagement with uh, milestones, um, uh, objectives, goals, and then actually, actually adding a social layer as well where people can now challenge each other, see how, uh, how far somebody else is running and do comparisons. So when you're really digging in deeper, gamification is the use of psychological tactics in order to engage your audience. So Nike is using psychological tactics to motivate people to run more. Now why is gamification so important? Uh, it's because it's been proven to be effective in extending engagement. Uh, it gives you an opportunity to collect massive amounts of data and then that data can then be crunched and analyzed in order to give you a deeper insight into what your audience is doing, which eventually can help you increase revenues. Now when you get into gamification, you have a wealth of digital tools to, to help you take boring and routine activities, add different layers of fun and interactivity, and promote people to actually do those activities and give you a way to track it. Now a lot of people confuse gamification with game design and game mechanics. Gamification is, those three terms are not interchangeable. Gamification takes elements from game design and game mechanics in order to create a strategy to help you engage your audience. Measurement is essential. I think you've heard people say quite a bit today that you want to test, test, test. Right? You're using digital technology, so the opportunities are endless in the amount of data that you can collect. Using tools like Google Analytics, Flurry Analytics, uh, crunch as much information as you can, A-B test the hell out of it, and ultimately look at different ways that you can maximize your ROI. Uh, the A-B testing is essential in terms of constantly improving uh, the experience, making sure that there's fresh new content, uh, new ways for the users to engage because as you remember, beginners are coming in two to three times a week, uh, two to three times a month, but you have your experts and your uh, brand advocates that are constantly in there and if there's no new experience, it's a failed, failed experience for them. In, in addition to the analytics and the A-B testing we're doing internally for our own um, measurement, we're also providing our retail partners in-depth knowledge into how their customers are interacting in their store uh, giving them the ability to A-B test their products and uh, validate online recommendations with actual sales. So the retailers are now providing a different, a different type of experience in store. Uh, gamification is not so much a game, but there is added value in the entertainment aspect of coming in and shopping at a retail location. Yeah.